Now for today's quick shot of Sips, Suds, and Smokes. Hey, this is good old gal Juliana from Sips, Suds, and Smokes. On this episode, we talked about simply beautiful beers. Barley, hops, yeast, and water. No barrels, no fruits, no nothing. We had a lot of great beers, but we narrowed it down to our top three. With the first one is good old boy Kendall. Not just barley, but this beer has a little bit of corn in it. That's Little Harpeth Chicken Scratch. It's an American-style pre-prohibition lager from Nashville's only lager brewery. Steve Scoville and his crew are creating some delicious lager beers, and this is a great one with that features Tennessee white corn. It's got a crisp, uh, light finish, but it also has a little bit of corn sweetness in the finish. It's a delicious beer. You need to get to Nashville and taste it yourself. And we gave it a... We gave it a Suds rating of four. Great. Four. A body should not really make that sound. <laughs> okay. And now with our second beer is good old boy Mike. Up in number two is a beer from Six Point Brewery out of Brooklyn, New York. It's called The Crisp. This is a Pilsner lager. Um, This is a 5.4% ABV. Our tasting notes on this is uh, everyone described it as kind of light, grassy, hay, a very dry finish. Everybody thought this was a very enjoyable beer and would definitely go back to it again. Our suds rating for the crisp is also a four as well. A body should really not make that sound. And with our third beer is good old boy Dave. So our third beer today was uh, Zen by Rheingeist. Uh, This is a Session Pale Ale, uh, 4.8%. It has Citra and Mosaic hops. It's very well balanced, uh, definitely sessionable, uh, and uh, just a well-rounded, delicious beer. We gave this one a four. A body should really not make that sound. Okay, you can hear all of these beers and more on this Simply Perfect episode on this radio station or any other podcast service. Once again, this is good old gal Juliana asking you to join us again and keep on sipping. This has been a One Tan Hand production of Sip, Suds, and Smokes, a program devoted to the appreciation of some of the finer slices of life. From the dude in the basement studios, your hosts, the good old boys, will see you all next time.